Nabil Fekser attracted a lot of sympathy when his move to Liverpool fell through this summer. Lauded as the perfect replacement for Philippe Coutinho, the playmaker looked all set to sign for the Reds. It was even rumoured he'd done his photo shoot and an interview with LFC TV, though that proved not to be the case. The French international was ultimately left devastated when the club pulled the plug over concerns about his long-standing knee injuries. Ever since, despite winning the World Cup, Fexer has never quite looked the same player. With his dream transfer shattered, the 25-year-old has had to focus once again on life in Ligue 1 and according to French newspaper Eloquip, he hasn't been doing a great job. They claim Leon are even considering selling him in January and that his recent performances have been a big talking point within the club. Not because they think he will attract a huge fee, as he would have done in August, but because he no longer inspires the team in his role as captain in the same way that he used to. The newspaper note that Leon wouldn't be opposed to him departing in the winter due to his contribution of just two goals and two assists in ten league games, compared to his 18 goals and seven assists in 30 appearances last season. The one exception that is cited is the number 10s performance in a 4-2 win over Marseille back in September. That result had Liverpool fans waxing lyrical about the midfielder and many even hoped George Ern Klopp would renew his interest in the new year. As it stands, that seems very unlikely, especially as the Premier League's second-placed side are faring just fine without him, sitting just two points behind pace-setters Manchester City. The truth is that while he only comes to the attention of fans around the world when he puts in some of his more vintage displays, Liverpool scouts will have been keeping a very close eye on him and won't have been too impressed by what they've seen. For Fixer personally, it appears he's still struggling to get over the disappointment, but perhaps Liverpool dodged a bullet after all. Do you think Liverpool were right not to sign Fexer? Have your say in the comments.